Okay, getting my screen set up. <clears throat> Oops, okay. <clears throat> sorry, sorry, hold on a second, sorry. Make sure everything is... Okay, okay, okay. All right. <clears throat> Hello, everyone. It's me, it's Mark, and I'm here with you for another live stream class, yay! Before I do anything, I need to know if you can see me and hear me. If you can see me, if you can hear me, please say yes in the chat so, I'm, so I know everything is A-OK. -okay. If you can see me, if you can hear me, please say yes in the chat so I know everything is A-OK. -okay. Tomas says yes. Okay, good. Tetsuro says yes. Thank you. Ella says yes. Thank you. Okay. It looks like everything is going well. All right. Hello, Mano May. Oh, Marion. Hello, Marion. Sabine is here. Hello, Sabine. Okay, good. Rav is here. All right. Well, like I always say, without you, there's no reason for me to be here. Thank you, Sabine. Saima, thank you. All right, Clayton is in the house. All right, well, you know what we do. We always have a toast for good luck. Let's do that. Aza, hello, Aza, thank you. So whatever you're drinking, pick it up. I have hot coffee right here, yes I do. I will toast with my hot coffee. <laughs> we will do two toasts, yes, two toasts. Our first toast is for the green team. You see them. Their names are in green. They support me. They support the channel. By supporting me and the channel, they are supporting everyone. So let's give the green team a big thank you. Cheers. If you don't have a beverage, we can fist bump. Bump. Cheers. Bump. Cheers. <clears throat> and because we had a toast, we have to have a drink. So bottoms up. Mmm. Woo. Very hot. <laughs> Miley is here. Hello, Miley. Great to see Miley in the house. Okay, our second toast, it's for you. Yes, without you, there's no reason for me to be here. So let's toast to you. Let's toast to fun, interesting, informative, and productive lesson today. Cheers, bump. Cheers, bump. And because we had a toast, we have to have a drink. Bottoms up. Mmm. Woo. Hey, Mary is in the house. Hello, Mary. Okay, good, good. All right, we have a good group. As always, we always have a great group in the chat. And talking about the chat, you must be a subscriber to enter the chat. I do that to keep the bots up, to keep the spamming out, so we have a safe and fun place to practice our English together. So if you want to enter the chat if you want to practice with us please subscribe I do that to keep the bots out to keep the spamming out so we have a safe and fun place to practice our English together you will see lots of great sentences in the chat you will learn a lot from the chat we help each other in the chat so please join us in the chat <laughs> okay good all right well let's talk about today's class and we're doing one two three activities today we're doing form a sentence this is a review from yesterday then we're going to review the worksheet 10 very short conversations we'll see a video and do the um, worksheet and then our third activity is remember last week we were um, confused about countable and uncountable nouns. And so, and I told you I would make two worksheets. So the, the worksheet we did last week, there was both countable and uncountable nouns on the same worksheet. And some people were getting confused, like when to use countable nouns, when to use uncountable nouns. And, and so I split the worksheet, and so I made two new worksheets one worksheet with only countable nouns 
and another worksheet, worksheet with only uncountable, uncountable nouns. And today's worksheet is, I think, countable nouns. So we will practice countable nouns, right? We can count them one, two, three, four, five. And, and so, for example, the um, conversation goes, how do you like the biscuits? I think they are delicious. I'm glad you like them. Would you care for some more? Yes, please, but not too many, just a few. So that is our pattern. And then next week we will do the uncountable nouns. So there's another worksheet for the uncountable nouns. So today the countable nouns, we can count them. For example, strawberries, grapes, donuts, ribs, pancakes, cherries, candies, tacos, all right? So we can, that's what we're doing for our third activity. And the worksheets are on my Patreon page, support me there. Get the worksheets we use in our live stream classes. There's many, 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 many worksheets right there. Help me there and I will help you here. <laughs> so there is a link to my Patreon page in the descriptions. Please check it out. $5 a month helps me and you get all the worksheets. Yeah, there are many, many. I'm sure there's over a hundred now. There's gotta be. Okay, so let's get right to it, shall we? Let's do form a sentence. Oh no, I dropped the sheet. Okay. Here it is. I got it right here. Okay, so let's do it. <clears throat> Form a sentence. This is our first activity. Okay. <clears throat> Form a sentence, and here we go. Here's the pattern. I am <clears throat> not. And then we need an um, ing verb. This, Base verb plus ing this week because and then state the reason why, right? When we use a negative, we want to state the reason why. So if it's a yes, if it's positive, you don't need to do that. For example, I am, I am working this week. Okay, right? But it's negative. So we need to give a reason why. So for example, I am not working this week because I'm on vacation. Or I'm not working this week because I'm sick. Or I'm not working this week because I'm on, I have to, <laughs> I have to volunteer at the hospital. Uh, I'm not working this week because the boss gave us the week off. So um, when it's a negative statement, you need to give a reason why. Like for example, do you like ice cream? No, because it has too much sugar or something like that. I don't know. So I am not ing this week because and so this is the the continuous right present continuous okay <clears throat> arts is in the house hey arts okay here we go hey Saima is here too Helga is here Helga says I am not drinking coffee now I have already okay Okay, here we go, Helga. I am not drinking coffee now because I already had coffee. Because <laughs> I already, or you could say, uh, I am not drinking coffee because I finished it. Or I am not drinking coffee now because I drank it all. <laughs> I don't know. Aaron, hello. Okay, Miley. I am not sleeping this week because for Easter, all my friends call late at night. <laughs> Aza, I am not working this month because I have lots of classes 
at my university, I have lots of classes, right? So you need countable. You have to make it plural, more than one class. I'm doing good, Arts. Thank you. Tetsu, I am staying up late this week because I have to get up early. Okay, so I am not, right? Don't forget the not. Mary, I am not eating sweets this week because I am on a diet. Yeah, I need to, I need to do the same thing. I had, you know, winter, right? Winter, you put on a few pounds during the winter. And so now spring is here. And so it's starting to get warmer. And so taking off the sweaters, taking off the jackets. <laughs> so we need, um, to lose some weight for spring and summer, right? Take off the winter, the winter, the winter fat. <laughs> okay, Helga, I am not working this week because it goes like that. <laughs> okay, okay, um, uh, Marion, that's Marion, I'm not, studying this week because I was busy all week. Sabine, I am not working this week because I am on vacation. Okay, Sabine, we say, I am on vacation. One more time, I am on vacation. Aza, I am not working this month because I have lots of classes at my university. Very good classes. Math class, English class, math class. Biology class, classes. Katie says, I am not drinking milk this week because I am recovering from a stomach illness. A stomach illness. Marcos is in the house. Hey, Marcos, how you doing, buddy? Marcos says, I am not exercising this week because I need a rest. Okay, salute. Cheers to having a rest. <laughs> I like having rest. Let's see. Man oh may. I am not going to a meeting this week because I am on vacation. Okay. I am not going to a meeting. Or you can say, I am not going to meetings. <clears throat> so you either have to have a or put meetings. You have two choices there, man oh may. Hi, meetings might be better. I am not going to meetings this week because I am on vacation. Mitra, I am not cooking this week because I'm, oh, eating out. I am not cooking this week because I am eating out. <clears throat> okay, Bethy, I am not going to the temple today because I don't feel well. I hope you feel better. Tomas, I'm not drinking beer this week because it makes me fat, okay? It makes me fat, okay? Tomas, one more time. It makes me fat. Saima, I am not watching this movie because I have already watched this movie. Or actually, you should say, I have already seen it. I am not watching this movie because I have already seen it. Sabine, I am not working this week because I'm on vacation, O-N. Okay, Sabine, on, O-N, on vacation. Mary, I'm not watching the news this week because I'm tired of it. I hear you, Mary. I hear you. I know, I, I, I have to do the same thing. Miley, I'm not going out because everyone comes to visit me for Easter, and so I'm cleaning the house. Nice, Miley, you're very popular. Many friends, so that's nice. You are entertaining friends, that's always fun. That, that's, you're, you're very fortunate, Miley. Umesh, I'm not meeting my friends this week because I'm busy. Nice. Marcos, I'm not shopping this week because I'm broke. Okay, not broke it. So, Marcos, things are broken, right? Like your computer is broken or your 
your printer is broken. People are broke. Like, oh, I, have no, I don't have any money. I'm broke. Tetsuro, I'm not eating spaghetti this week because I would rather eat curry and rice. You, you don't need then it. You could just say, I'd rather eat curry and rice. Tetsuro loves curry and rice. <laughs> Maybe that's Tetsuro's favorite meal, curry and rice. Yeah, so um, makes me because beer makes, right? Because it's a thing, right? It makes, he makes, she makes. It makes, beer makes. Okay, Helga, I'm not eating much bread this week because I'm lazy to go shopping. Yes, Sabine, on vacation. Okay, good, good, good. Let's change. I'm looking at the clock. Let's change topics let's see arts i have never seen it because i have been on vacation okay right here tetsuro i am not applying for a university this week because i don't have enough money okay i'm not a, i'm not applying for university so we don't need uh Aza, i'm not going outside because it's raining a lot sabine I'm not shopping this week because I need to save money. Very good. Umesh, I'm not buying a car because I do not have enough money. I do not have enough money. I'm not eating spaghetti this week because I would rather eat curry and rice. Very good. Okay, we're changing topics, everyone. Well done. No problem. You guys had no problem with this pattern it's a useful pattern so well done let's change topics we're going to do 10 very short conversations this is a review from yesterday <clears throat> 10 very short conversations we're in See a vid. We're going to watch a video and do a worksheet. Okay, let's do it. <clears throat> I'm going to put the video on the screen so we can do it together. No, that's the worksheet. We want the video. There's the video. Let's make, whoa, let's make it full screen, shall we? So, okay, number 10 or 12. This is set 12. Okay, here we go. Let's do it together. I think that's a good idea. Here we go. Now we're going to say this sentence three times together. <clears throat> Sorry, I need some water here. Okay. Can you please set the table? Can you please set the table? Can you please set the table? Yes, I can. Yes, I can. Yes, I can. Can you please set the table? Yes, I can. Worms are gross. Worms are gross. Worms are gross. Why are you touching it? Why are you touching it? Why are you touching it? Worms are gross. Why are you touching it? We need cereal. We need cereal. We need cereal. I'll get it. I'll get it. I'll get it. We need cereal. I'll get it. What do you recommend? What do you recommend? 
What do you recommend? Our tacos are popular. Our tacos are popular. Our tacos are popular. What do you recommend? Our tacos are popular. How do they fit? How do they fit? How do they fit? Perfectly, perfectly, perfectly. How do they fit? Perfectly. What do you need from the supermarket? What do you need from the supermarket? What do you need from the supermarket? Get some pickles. Get some pickles. Get some pickles. What do you need from the supermarket? Get some pickles. Can I have that teddy bear? Can I have that teddy bear? Can I have that teddy bear? How much is it? How much is it? How much is it? Can I have that teddy bear? How much is it? There's a concert later. There's a concert later. There's a concert later. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. There's a concert later. Let's go. <clears throat> Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? I'm going for a walk. I'm going for a walk. I'm going for a walk. Where are you going? I'm going for a walk. What you doing? What you doing? What you doing? I'm flying a kite. I'm flying a kite. I'm flying a kite. <clears throat> okay, now it's your turn. I will go first. I will be the purple sentences. And? You will go second. You will be the blue sentences. Can you please set the table? Worms are gross. We need cereal. What do you recommend? How do they fit? What do you need from the supermarket?
Can I have that teddy bear? There's a concert later. Where are you going? What you doing? Let's switch. You will go first. You will be the purple sentences and I will go second. I will be the blue sentences. Yes, I can. Why are you touching it? I'll get it. Our tacos are popular. Perfectly. Get some pickles. How much is it? Let's go. Uh-oh. There's a mistake right there. Oh, God. Sorry. Okay. There's a concert later. That's not a question. Not a question. It's a mistake. So it should be a period. There is a concert later. Period. There is a concert later. Period. Not question mark. That is a mistake. It should be a period. So sorry. There is no, that is not a question. There's a concert later is a statement. So there should be a period, not a question mark. Sorry about that. I'm going for a walk. Flying a kite. Okay, yep, yep, yep. All right, so there we go. That is the video. Now let's do the worksheet. There it is. So you're going to write sentences in the chat, right? Of course. And you can get the worksheet on my Patreon right there. Okay, let's make it larger, shall we? And so, as you know, as you know, right, this review, the, the, at the top is the conversation then we have a pattern and then we have an example of the pattern. So one more time, at the top is the conversation that's in the video. Below it is a pattern from the conversation. Below the pattern is an example sentence 
of the pattern. Okay, so we're going to do look at all three, of course. Let's make it larger. Okay, so number one, conversation one. Can you please set the table? Yes, I can. The pattern, can you? Example, can you cook well? Conversation two, worms are gross. Why are you touching it? Pattern, why are you? Example, why are you going early? Conversation three, we need cereal. I'll get it. Pattern, we need. Example, we need more milk. Conversation four, <clears throat> what do you recommend? Our tacos are popular. Pattern, what do? Example, what do they want? Number five, how do they fit? Perfectly. Pattern, how do? Example, how do we get home? Six, conversation six. What do you need from the supermarket? Get some pickles. Pattern, get some. Example, get some for me. So let's, let's do those right now. So we got six. Let's do the six right now. So the six patterns for the moment. Can you? Why are you? We need. What do? How do? Get some. One more time. Can you? Why are you? We need. What do? How do? Get some. Okay, Matsura. Hello, Matsura. Number one, can you please pass the salt? Yes, I can. Very good. Helga, can you help me? Yes, for sure. Okay, Aza, can you cook well? I think so. It's my hobby. I like it, Aza. Helga, why are you listening to classic music? Because I like it. Tetsuro, can you help me? Of course. I'll do everything for you. Okay, Miley. Can you drive for me? I don't know how to drive this car. Sabine, can you play the guitar? Yes, I can. So Sabine, with musical instruments, we say the. We use the for musical instruments. For example, can you play the piano? Can you play the guitar? Can you play the drums? Can you play the violin? Can you play the trumpet. Can you play the horn? Can you play the clarinet? Mitra, can you play tennis? Yes, I can. Helga, we need more space. I'll, I will take out my bag. Helga, I will. Aza, why are you going early? Because I will be late for the office. I will be late for the office, the office. Let's see, Matsura, why are you doing that? It's, oh, oh okay, Matsura, why are you doing that? You need a car. You need a car. Like, you need a car to do that. Why are you doing that? You need a car. Miley, why are you crying? Because I'm happy. That's a happy cry. I like it. There you go. Can you play the guitar? Good, Sabine. Helga, what do you think about this picture? It's wonderful. Or you could say, I think it's wonderful. What do you think about this picture? I think it's wonderful. Marcos, why do they... What? Sorry, sorry, Marcos. What do they need? They need love and happiness. 
We all need love and happiness. There you go. I will take out my bag. Good, Helga. Tetsuro, why are you playing video games? Because I have free time. Okay, Ran, hello. Ran, Ran, hello, Ran. Aza, why are you going early? Because I will be late for the office. Very good. There you go, Matsa. You need a car. <laughs> Helga, how do we get money? We will go, we will rob the bank. It's a joke, of course. Of course, it's a joke. Don't, don't, don't rob a bank or you will be in big trouble. You will be sorry. Aza, we need more milk for breakfast. Okay. Aza, we need more milk for breakfast. We need more milk for breakfast. There you go, Helga. I think it's wonderful. Sabine, why are you sad? I lost my key. I would be sad too. Okay, let's look at the others down here. Okay, we got four. We got four, five, six. We got ten here. Okay, four. There we go. That's a little better. Okay, we'll, we'll let's let's do this for now. Let's do this. Okay. Um. Okay. No, we got. We did. Six, yeah. Okay. Seven. Okay. That that's that's good. Okay. Here we go. Seven. Conversation seven. Can I have that teddy bear? How much is it? Pattern. Can I? Example. Can I go with you? Conversation eight. There's a concert later. Let's go. There's. The pattern is there's. The example, there's some over there. Number nine. Where are you going? I'm going for a walk. Pattern, where are you? Example, where are you originally from? And then 10, what you doing? I'm flying a kite. Pattern, I'm, example, I'm having fun. Okay, there we go. Okay, Tetsuro, we need more time. We can go hiking. Miley, we need more altru or autism or altruism. Oh, I can't say it. Altruis ah. Altruism. There we go. Altruism. 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 I can't say it fast. Altruism. Altruism. Uh, we find it if you come with me where people suffer. Okay, Sabine, good question. Mar uh, um, Sabine asks, whatcha? So that means, so um, what are you? So those three words, what are you? We put them together, whatcha? So for example, what are you doing? We put it together, whatcha doing? What are you? Whatcha? Whatcha doing? What are you doing? Helga. What do we need for breakfast? Get some coffee, a lemon, and cookies. Matsura, we need a big car. We need a big car <laughs> because it's a lot. Oh, 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 okay. Because we have a lot of rice. I see, I see. Because it's a big sack of rice. <laughs> we need a big car. Why do we need a big car? Because it's a big sack of rice. It's a big sack of rice or it's a heavy sack of rice. It's a heavy sack of rice. Okay, Marion, why are you going to the mortuary? Tetsuro, uh, what, 
what are you, what do you, okay, okay, Tessa, we need more information. For example, what do you eat every day or what do you eat on Sundays? What do you eat? So we need like a time phrase there, Tessa. What do you eat、um, for lunch? What do you eat every Tuesday? Marcos, how do you feel? I feel like a bat out of hell. <laughs> That's a great song, great album. That's Meatloaf, right, Marcos? I like Meatloaf. That's a band. Meatloaf is a food and a band. <laughs> Tetsuro, how, how do your shoes fit perfectly? How good? Can I take this vase? Yes, but be careful. Aza, what do they want? They want to go outside right now. Miley, what do they ask? They want to know how much it costs. Marion, I need more money to pay the bills. To pay the bills. To pay the bills. Matsura, what are you tidying up? Why are you tidying up? Because they are coming today. So, why are you tidying up? Because guests are coming today. Because guests are coming today. Tetsuo, get some hamburgers. I love them. Okay, good, Sabine. Tetsuo, can I go out? Sure. Marion, what you, what you like to drink? Okay, now what are you? So, what you drinking? Okay, Marion. So, what you equals what are you? What you? So, what are you drinking? Aza, how do we get how do we get there by taxi? Marcos, can I call you later? Yes, I'll be waiting. So, okay, yes, and I'll be waiting. Okay, you can do either way, Marcos. You can say, yes, and I'll be waiting, or yes, I'll be waiting. So, either way is okay. Bethy, can I go with you? Sorry, I am in a rush. Maybe next time. Helga, there's a nice view. Yes, the mountains are beautiful. Okay, Matsura, I don't know what that word is. S A K I V. Miley, how do we get back? We take the train. Marion, how do you, how does, how does that dress fit? How does that dress fit? Because、um, dress, you need the does. How do you? How do I? How do we? How do they? How does it? How does he? How does she? Okay, Maitra, why are you in a hurry? In a hurry. I'm late for my job. Okay. Well, I'm looking at the clock. We got to finish up here. We got another worksheet to do. Okay, Aza, can I go with you? Sure, you can. Tetsuo, there's a post office around here. Okay, let's go. Get some cheese for me. Get some cheese for me. Where are you sending this message? To my friend. Okay, so Helga, we don't need the two there. Where are you sending this message? Miley, take some flowers for me. Marcos, what you doing? I'm having breakfast. Good. Matza, it's a good dress. It looks great. It looks great. Get a few apples. What you doing? 
I'm planting tomatoes and some vegetables. Tetsuo, where are you in Tokyo? I live in Ota Ward. Helga, what she? Okay, we don't need the you. What you feeding? Okay, um, I'm feeding the fish in the lake. Okay, um, we you don't need feeding, just doing. That's that works. What you doing? I'm feeding the fish in the lake. Okay, so we don't need feeding. What you doing? And then I'm feeding the fish in the lake. Sabine, what you cooking today? I'm cooking pasta. I like it, Sabine. What you cooking today? What you cooking today? <laughs> what you cooking today? Uh, Matsura, what do you need? We need, we need some money. <laughs> we need to get some money. Marley, can I have that drawing? Yes, it's a free offer for refugees. Tetsuro, I'm reading a book. That's good. Can I get your Wi-Fi password? That's, that's very, we use that a lot. Can I get your Wi-Fi password? When you go into someone's house maybe, or you're staying in a hotel and you need the, you need to get the Wi-Fi. And so there's always a password. So you ask the front desk, can I get your Wi-Fi password? Miley says, there's a peace fundraiser. Let's go. Mm-hmm. Helga, what you doing? I'm feeding the fish in the lake. Good, good. Okay, you know what? We're going to go to our next topic here. We're going to go to our next activity. One more activity. This, this is a review from yesterday. We did this yesterday. And um, good sentences, everyone. Please um, support me on Patreon and you get the worksheets we do in our live stream classes right there. You get those. This worksheet is on my Patreon. Go there, support me there, $5 a month, and you get all the worksheets we do in our live stream classes. Please support me there. Hello, Gene. Here we go, Gene. We're gonna practice, okay, Gene? <laughs> We're doing it, Gene. Okay, you're welcome, Jean. Okay, let's go to our next worksheet, okay? So our next worksheet is countable nouns. So our next, and it's food. And so, for example, strawberries, it ends with an S. We can count them, right? And you could see them, you, could, you can pick them up. Here's one strawberry, two strawberries, three strawberries, right? And then we have grapes. We can hold them, pick them. One grape, two grapes, three grapes. Donuts, right? We can, we can count them. How many donuts can you eat? I can eat three donuts. <laughs> and then ribs, right? They're, they're, um, you could have spare ribs. You can have pork ribs and you can have beef ribs. And there's bones, and so you can, you can count them. How many ribs do you want? I'll have three, please. So you can just cut them and you can, you know, you can have them individually, right? One rib, two ribs, three ribs. Pancakes, right? We can count them. How many pancakes do you want? I'll have four, please. Four pancakes. Cherries, we can, we can count them. How many cherries do you want? Or, you know, like cherries are expensive. So just eat a little, <clears throat> or just eat a few, I should say, right? Cherries are expensive, so just have a few. And then um, candy can go both ways, right? So you can use candy as singular or plural. And so usually like the, the little ones are candies. Oh, let's have, please get some candies for the party. And so those are kind of like um, the small ones. So candy can be both. You can say candies or candy. So either way is okay. So I put it for countable, but it can also be uncountable. And then tacos, we can count tacos. How many tacos did you order? I ordered three tacos. Okay, so we're doing 
countable nouns. I'm going to put it on the board so we can practice together. And then next week, we will do uncountable. Okay, so let's get the countable. Let me write the, the pattern on the, on the board, okay? So this is the, the conversation we're, we're practicing today. So countable nouns. Right, so nouns are things. Well, in, in, here are things, right? Food. So nouns can be people, places, things, right? And so food, so these are things. <clears throat> and so we can count them. We could count these things nouns, okay? And so our, our pattern goes, um, how do you like... Let's put the, because we're using the because that is determined, right? We can see it. Um, we are talking about it, okay? Right, so we're using the, because I can see it, you can see it, we are talking about it, so we're using the. So, for example, how do you like the strawberries? How do you like the grapes? How do you like the donuts? Okay, so we're using the because it's in front of us. We are talking about it, so we're using the. And then B says, I think they're delicious. Okay, so here we're using they are, okay? And, and this is a pronoun for, for the thing. So, for example, how do you like the strawberries? I think they are delicious. So, strawberries, they are. So, countable, strawberries, they are. How do you like the grapes? I think they are delicious. How do you like the donuts? I think they are delicious. So... Right, so it equals the same. Um, how do you like the ribs? I think, so we could say, I think the ribs are delicious, or they are, right? So let's say ribs, right? How do you like the ribs? I think the ribs are. Okay, so... I think the ribs are delicious, or we can just say they are delicious, right? So it's easier to say they are. Um, how do you like the pancakes? I think they are delicious. How do you like the cherries? I think they are delicious. How do you like the candies? I think they are delicious. How do you like the tacos? I think they are delicious, okay? And then continues, A says... I'm glad you like them. Okay, so I'm glad you like them. And here, them equals the ribs. Okay, so we could say, I'm glad you like the ribs. So here, if you want to use ribs, 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 or we could use pronouns, right? So, how do you like the ribs? I think the ribs are delicious. I'm glad you like the ribs. So it kind of sounds strange, right? So that's why we use pronouns. We substitute the nouns. So um, we, start, we start with that name, right? We start off with the name, the noun, the name. Then we go, to, then we go pronouns. So how do you like the ribs? I think they are delicious. I'm glad you like them. Okay? You can say, how do you like the ribs? I think the ribs are delicious. I'm glad you like the ribs. But that's not natural. And then, and then, um, oh, and then, would you care for some more? Would you care 
for some more. Okay, so we're offering more, right? Would you care for some more? I'm glad you like them. Would you care for some more? Now, um, right, so you, how do you like the ribs? Mm -hmm. I think they are delicious. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm glad you like them. Would you care for some more? So I got more. Are you still hungry? Do you want more ribs? And then B says, B says, yes, please. Yes, please. But not too many. Yes, please, but not too many, just a few. Okay, so <clears throat> for example, okay, so I'm glad you like them. Would you care for some more? Oh, yes, please, but not too many. So I'm already getting, I'm starting to get full, right? So I've had a few ribs, they're delicious. Um, I could eat maybe one or two more, right? So, yes, please, but not too many. Don't give me five more. Don't give me six more ribs. Just a few. So maybe that's like two. Two more would be, that's perfect, right? I don't want to be too full. I don't want to be sick because I ate too many ribs. So just, just a few. And so um, because it's countable, ribs, we use um, not too many just a few, okay? So that's the pattern we use with countable nouns. Remember, uncountable nouns, it's a little different, but today we are only doing countable nouns, so this is the pattern. So let's, let's have a look at the worksheet. So let's do it one more time and then you'll see the worksheet. Here we go. How do you like the ribs? I think they are delicious. I'm glad you like them. Would you care for some more? Yes, please. But not too many, just a few. 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 Okay, that's the pattern. Okay, where is the worksheet? There's the worksheet right there. Okay, so there is, right? So here's this and it's right here, right? Let me make it a little bit larger. Let's make it larger. There we go. Okay, so you can see it easily now. Okay, so A, how do you like the biscuits? We can count them, one, two, three, four. I think they are delicious. I'm glad you like them. Would you care for some more? Yes, please, but not too many, just a few. Not too many, just a few. Not too many, just a few. How do you like the biscuits? I think they are delicious. I'm glad you like them. Would you care for some more? Would you care for some more? Would you care for some more? Yes, please, but not too many, just a few. Would you care for some more? Yes, please, but not too many, just a few. Would you care for some more? Yes, please, but not too many, just a few. Would you care for some more? Yes, please, but not too many, just a few. <laughs> okay, there we go. Now, it's your turn to make the sentences. Okay, let's look. So, let's look at the six, the first six right now. We have number one, the strawberries. They are delicious. Not too many, just a few. Number two, the grapes. They're delicious. Number three, the donuts. They are delicious. 
the ribs. Number four, they're delicious. Number five, the pancakes, they are delicious. Number six, the cherries, they are delicious. Good, Maitra. Oh, good, 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 Marion. Yeah, last time we mixed them, so it's better to, to do the same, the same pattern, right? So it was my mistake last time. I shouldn't have mixed them together, uncountable and countable. So it's better to, to separate them. So this worksheet is only countable. Next week, we will do uncountable, a worksheet with uncountable. Helga, how do you like the strawberries? I think they're delicious. I'm glad you like them. Would you care for some more? Yes, please. Not too many, just a few. Tetsuro, how do you like the strawberries? I think they're delicious. I'm glad you like them. Would you care for some more? Yes, please. But not too many, just a few. Okay, Maitra. Yep. How do you like the biscuits? I think they're delicious. I'm glad you like them. Would you like some more? Yes, please, but not too many, just a few. Oh, Betty, how do you like the lasagna? Okay, now, lasagna is uncountable. So, remember, okay, the, they end with an S. So, countable nouns end with an S. Okay, so the noun ends with an S, right? So biscuits, strawberries, grapes, donuts. Lasagna is not countable, okay? That's next week. So be careful. The nouns have to end with an S. Okay, let's see. Tetsuro, how do you like the grapes? I think they're delicious. I'm glad you like them. Would you care for some more? Yes, please, but not too many, just a few. Helga, how do you like the grapes? I think they are delicious. I'm glad you like them. Would you care for some more? Yes, please, but not too many. Yeah, just a few, not too not too many, just a few. Tetsu, how do you like the donuts? I think they are delicious. I'm glad you like them. Would you care for some more? Yes, please, but not too many, just a few. Sonia, hello. How do you like the strawberries? I think they are delicious. I'm glad you like them. Would you care for some more? Yes, please, but not too many, just a few. Okay, Tetsuro, how do you like the ribs? I think they're delicious. I'm glad you like them. Would you care for some more? Yes, please, but not too many, just a few. Okay, Matsa, how do you like the strawberries? I think they're delicious. I am glad you like them. Would you care for some more? Yes, please. Just a few. Hanen, hello. Good, good, good. Steak, Marcos, is uncountable, right? We, we don't say steaks. Well, 
I guess. Let's. Ha I, I think it's maybe. Let's have. Let's get some steaks. I. I, I think you know, Marcos. That's a. That's a. Inter yeah. So steak is generally, in most cases, uncountable. Some situations, like let's say a group of people, let's say, you know, your, your dentist buddies, right? So maybe you, you meet with your fellow dentists, your group of dentists, and you go, hey, let's go out and get some steaks. Because you're, 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 you're thinking each person's going to have a steak, right? So um, we, 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 so, so I wouldn't use steak here, right? It would be better, um, you say, just a little, right? So a few means it's countable. So uh, I'll have a few steaks. So that sounds strange, right? So usually we just have like one steak. It could be a big steak. It could be a small steak. And, and then like you cut it, right? And, and so steak is for this situation using, using uh, we don't use steak for many and few, okay? So that would be just a little, not, um, not too much, right? So for uncountable, it's much. So for steak, not too much, right? So you're cutting, you're, you got a side of beef, right? You got, you got a side of beef and, okay, how much steak do you want? Uh, just, just, just a little, not, not too much, just a little. So, so it, it depends on the situation, Marcos. Like, let's get some steaks. That works. But in, in this, um, this pattern, don't use it for countable. Okay, let, let's look at the, the, the rest here. Okay, so we got seven is candies. And so these are like little candies, right? So like, like if, if you go to a party and there's little candies or Halloween candies, right? Small. So we're going to, candy can be countable or uncountable. We're using it today as countable because they're like little individual pieces. They are, they're wrapped in paper or a little package. And so we can count the packages. We can count you know, the individual candies. So in this situation, we're using it for countable, but it can be also uncountable. So here, number seven, candies, because it's wrapped its own little piece there. And then number eight, tacos. And number nine is your own original conversation. Oh, Sonia, how do you like the pastries? I think they're delicious. I'm glad you like them. Would you care for some more? Yes, please, but not too many, just a few. Good, I like it. Pastries, yes. <clears throat> Aza, how do you like the grapes? I think they are delicious. I'm glad you like them. Would you care for some more? Yes, please but not too many, just a few. Very good. Tetsuro, how do you like the candies? I think they're delicious. I'm glad you like them. Would you care for some more? Yes, please, but not too many, just a few. Okay, Matsa, how do you like the donuts? I think they are delicious. I'm glad you like them. Would you care for some more? Yes, please, just a few. Helga, how do you like the cherries? I think they are delicious. I'm glad you like them. Would you care for some more? Yes, please, but not too many, just a few. Shams, how do you like the strawberries? I think they are delicious. I'm glad you like them. Would you care for some more? Yes, please, but not too many, just a few. Shams, that's perfect. Oh, Carlos, thank you very much. I'm glad. Tetsuro, number eight, how do you like the tacos? I think they are delicious. I'm glad you like them. Would you care for some more? Yes, please, but not too many, just a few. Mm. 
So the worksheet you can see in the bottom, you, you do your own sentences at the bottom. So you can get the worksheets at Patreon, everyone. Support me there and you get all the worksheets. Okay, honey, how do you like the cherries? I think they are delicious. Would you care for some more? Yes, please, but not too many, just a few. Matza, how do you like the ribs? I think they are delicious. I'm glad you like them. Would you care for some more? Yes, please, just a few. Okay, number nine, here we go, original sentences. Original conversation, Tetsuo, how do you like the hamburgers? I think they are delicious. I'm glad you like them. Would you care for some more? Yes, please. Not too many, just a few. Now, hamburgers, okay, that's kind of tricky too, because maybe small ones like sliders, you know, like, so now you, some restaurants, they call them sliders and they're, they're small. And so there you can have like two or three, right? But when you have like a big hamburger, you know, usually we don't have a few. <laughs> That's too much, right? So too many hamburgers. So um, usually if you have like a, we wouldn't, it wouldn't be here. We can count hamburgers, right? So they're countable. You're correct, Tetsuo. But um, would you care, that'd be like, yes, one more, right? You wouldn't say um, just a few hamburgers, please. No, that, that's too many. You could say, oh, that was really good. Can I have one more, right? Oh, that hamburger was great. Can I have one more? But um, yeah, so, if, but they're doing like little sliders, small ones, and that, that's fine. Actually, um, sometimes I'll go to McDonald's and I'll just get like two hamburgers, like the, their normal small size ones I like. Oh, Tessera has a big stomach. <laughs> okay. <laughs> then that's fine. That's good. Hamburgers are countable, so that's fine. <clears throat> oh, there's I. How do you like the candies? I think they are so sweet. Some are sour, but I like it. Would you care for some more? Yes, please. But I should not eat a lot because they're not good for my teeth. <clears throat> okay, here we go. Marion, how do you like the pancakes? I think they are delicious. <clears throat> I'm glad you like them. Would you care for some more? Yes, please. But not too many. Just a few. Matza, how do you like the pancakes? I think they are delicious. I'm glad you like them. Would you care for some more? Yes, please. Just a few. Okay, we're gonna do just a few more minutes, okay? A few more minutes. So if you wanna write your sentences, do it now. Aza, how do you like the ribs? I think they're delicious, I'm glad you like them. Would you care for some more? Yes, please, but not too many, just a few. Very good, Aza. I like ribs. I can eat a lot of ribs with, with barbecue sauce. I love ribs. <laughs> okay, Helga. <laughs> Chebureki. 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 What what is Chebureki? Helga, tell us about Chebureki. What's it made of? What is it? 
Okay, Sonia, number nine. Here we go. Original. How do you like the sandwiches? I think they are delicious. I'm glad you like them. Would you care for some more? Yes, please. Not too many, just a few. So those like, no, sandwiches, right? You can have small, you can have small sandwiches. They're kind of like finger food, right? Like at a party, you go to a party and there's small sandwiches. You know, you make a sandwich and you cut it into small pieces. And so that works for this pattern. Oh, really? That's good. Oh, I, I'm surprised, Helga. I did the correct pronunciation. Usually I'm way off. I did it. Chebureki. <laughs> nope, I did it wrong. But what, what is it, Helga? Tell us, please. Hey, Roberto is here. Roberto's in the house. How do you like the donuts? I think they are delicious. I'm glad you like them. Would you care for some more? Yes, please, but not too many, just a few. That is correct, Marion. Not too many, we use with countable. Marcos, do you like the strawberries? I think they are delicious. I'm glad you like them. Would you care for some more? Yes, please, but not too many, just a few. Shams, how do you like the ribs? I think they're delicious. I'm glad you like them. Would you care for some more? Yes, please, but not too many. Just a few, not too many. Aza, how do you like the pancakes? I think they're delicious. I'm glad you like them. Would you care for some more? Yes, please, but not too many, just a few. Okay, I, here we go, original. How do you like the oranges? I think they're delicious. Oh. Okay, we're going to do a couple more, a few more minutes, okay? And then, oh, we're going to, and then let's look at the, the poll. Yesterday, I forgot about the poll yesterday. Today, I'm writing it on the board poll so I don't forget. So we'll look at the poll today in a few minutes. Oh, here we go, Roberto, original. How do you like the Fiorda? I think it's, okay, now, Roberto, we're using countable. Countable. So it has to be an S, Fiordas. So they are, so you can see the, here's the pattern right here. How do you like the biscuits? I think they are delicious. I'm glad you like them. Would you care for some more? Yes, please, but not too many, just a few. So we're doing countable nouns today. Next week, we will do uncountable nouns. Okay, well, I'm looking at the clock. Let, let's, let's look at the poll now. Um, what we'll, what we'll do, this is the plan. Oh, okay. Sounds, it sounds delicious. Helga, that sounds delicious. Sounds like I would like it. <laughs> sounds something, sounds like something I would like. Um, okay, so today, this worksheet today is about countable nouns. Next week, we're going to do a worksheet with uncountable nouns. And then the week after that, we're going to mix it. Okay, so, so last week we did the mix. Yeah, we did countables and uncountables, and that was confusing. So today we're doing only countables. Next week, we will do only uncountables. And then the week after that, we're going to mix it up. And hopefully, you're going to be able to understand the differences, when to use, when to use, um, not too many, just a few, and when to use <clears throat> not too much, just a little. Okay, so that's the tricky part. And here we'd say they are, but for uncountable, you say it's, 
and then I'm glad you like it. But for countables, we use they are delicious. I'm glad you like them. <clears throat> so for uncountable, like coffee, right? There's no S. So how do you like the coffee? I think it's delicious. I'm glad you like it. <clears throat> Would you care for some more? Yes, please. But not too much. Just a little. Okay, so that's next week. That's next week. <clears throat> and then the week after that, we're going to mix it together and you're going to use both. Okay? So that's our challenge. So next week, that's what we'll do. Uncountable next week. Okay. So let's, again, Patreon, everyone, please, please, please go to Patreon. Support me there. Get the worksheets. <laughs> All right. So let's... um. Go to the poll now. Now, in the chat, on the top of the chat, is a poll. It is a question. It's a quiz. Let's have a look. I'm going to open it up here. Now, 68 people voted. Thank you very much, everyone, for doing that. Now, the question. Do you sometimes feel shy? In what situations? <coughs> All right. So, do you sometimes feel shy? In what situations? Do you sometimes feel shy? In what situations? Now here are the situations to choose from. We have at a party, at work, at school, in public. Okay, so these are four situations. At a party, <clears throat> at work, in a school, or at school, I should say, in public. Okay, in which situation do you feel shy? Most shy, I should say. So, 38% um, said at a party. So, 38% said they feel shy at a party. 15% said they feel shy at work. 12% said they feel shy at school, and 35% said they feel shy in public. So, most people here in our chat who came to the video, came to the live stream, feel shy at a party. So, party, feel, um, do you sometimes feel shy? In what situation? And so most people said at a party and then in public. So in public would be like outside, maybe in a park, uh, in, a, in a shopping mall, in a sporting event, you know, where there's lots of people in public. So it's not private. It's not your home. It's not school. It's not work. It's in public out. Anyone can go there. Anyone can go there. That means it's public, right? If anyone can go, for example, at a park, right? Anyone can go to a park. That's public. Anyone can enter a sporting event. You have to, you have to buy a ticket, but anyone can buy a ticket, right? Um, a concert is public, right? Anyone can buy a ticket. And so um, that's public in public. And then the third was at work and then at school was only 12 percent. Tetsuro, so Matsu says in public. Tetsuro says maybe I feel the most shy in public. Okay, good, um, Roberto. Countable, right? So nouns that end with an S, right? Things that we can count, pancakes, grapes, strawberries, Tacos, donuts, croissants, cookies, <laughs> um, uh, what else? Tomatoes, apples. Okay, uh, Marion says, at a party, it's hard for me to socialize. Sabine in public. So a lot of people here in public, right? Maybe they feel a little shy in public.
Okay, good, good, good. All right, well, um, that's good for today. Um, I will be back on Friday, everyone. So today is Wednesday, and I will be back on Friday, but in the morning. So、um, 10 a.m. Japan time. I live in Japan. So Friday at 10 a.m. Japan time. Also Saturday, 10 a.m. Japan time. So I'm here on Tuesdays, Wednesdays, Thursdays, Fridays. Yeah, Tuesdays, Wednesdays, 5 p.m. Fridays, Saturdays, 10 a.m. in the morning. Okay, so I hope you will come back with me on Friday. Okay, so come back. And see me on Friday, 10 a.m. Japan time. You're welcome, Helga. You're very welcome. Okay, so、um, everyone, thank you again. Love and peace. Smile. Stay healthy. Be safe. That's right. I always say that because it's very important to smile. It's important to smile. It's important to be healthy. It's important to stay safe.、Uh, thank you, Marcos. You are very kind. Thank you, Tetsuro. You are very kind. Thank you, Green Team. You guys are very, very kind to me. You support me each month. You join the, the channel. Your names are in green. You help me. And I really, really appreciate that very much. Okay, everyone. Let's say goodbye together until Friday. Yeah, I'll be back on Friday. So until Friday, let's count down. You're welcome, Marcos. So let's count down together. Thank you, Bethy. Thank you, Sabine. Thank you, Sonia. Thank you, I. Thank you, Ella. Thank you, Matsura. Thank you, Hanan. Oh, Matsura, everyone, you guys are very kind. Thank you so much. Aza, take it easy. Hey, Aza, good luck in school. Shams, thank you very much. Okay, let's count down. Let's say goodbye together. Here we go. We're counting down. Five, four, three, two, one. One. Okay, thank you so much, everyone. I will be back on Friday. Please come back and see me on Friday. That will be April 7th at 10 a.m. Japan time. Okay, see you then. Until then, peace and love. Take it easy. Smile. Be healthy. Stay safe. Bye. Thank you.